And we also have some good news to report from yesterday's snowstorm. A dog who was thrown from a car has now been found safe. New at 6, Tom Murray was there for what could be called a very emotional reunion. A heartwarming story, Tom. Well, Carol, a woman hurt in that Racine County chain reaction crash had plenty to worry about with her own injuries, but she tells me all she could think about was her dog lost in the freezing cold. I can't even describe how happy I am. Valerie Neinheis is smiling her, despite painful injuries. Out. I had a concussion and um, strained, sprained my neck. At For Pet's Sake Vet Clinic in Sturdivant, Kira is contently resting in her pet parent's lap. Exhausted, dehydrated, and hungry after surviving a frigid night outside. Her pads are cut up pretty, pretty good, but she's going to be all right. Valerie was on her way home to Madison. This is a cell phone pic of her car after she got hit from behind on I-94 by a semi. And then I got hit by two more cars, and I finally stopped moving. And once I stopped moving, I thought about getting out, but I didn't for some reason. And. Two seconds later, I got hit again. Valerie could not find her beloved Kira, a six-year-old lab beagle mix. I don't know if she jumped out or if she was thrown out, but either way, she made it out fairly safe. Safe but gone. While Valerie was in the hospital, this missing poster went up on Facebook. Valerie's mom says everyone wanted to help. Just by all of our friends and family and social media and getting the word out there and people were saying, we've seen her, we saw her here, we saw her there. Calls came in early this morning. Kira had been found more than a mile from the crash site. Her tail started wagging and it's like, okay, what took you so long to get here? Just everybody, I can't, I can't thank them enough. Pet and owner reunited, really thanks to a viral social media effort. Mike and Carol. That's a nice story. Thank you, Tom.